Hi everyone. Right, I'm just going to be showing you now how to do um, a night scene. And first of all, what I'm going to take is a little bit of white on the end of my brush and work out where I'm going to have my sun setting. And I'm going to have that there. And I go in with a light yellow. Like that. I'll probably go over that. Um, because this is where I'm going to start and build up with my colours. In fact, I will do I can put that in later. I'm just going to brush on. This is using acrylic paints. I'll show you an easy way to do it. Let's brush them right in. Um, and that's um, that was using the let me just look the lemon yellow, and now I'm going to be using the cadmium yellow. And we're just going to work round that and go over it as well. Can wet my brush a little bit to blend that in more. And then I'm just going to use a little bit of the burnt sienna. And I'm not worried at all about it, whether it blends in or not. Because you can just go over it and build on it. Wet my little brush. Oops, a hair in that. And blend that right in. What we're making it is to blending it in here um, and taking it slightly across the page. And then take the black. And I'm going to be blending that in as well. doing round the edges quite rough and then I'm going to take red crimson red it is and blend that in with it oops sorry gone to black again I always do that, I have all the lids put out on the front of me and I always get the wrong one just go back in with the red and that's going to blend in with the black and taking this to almost nothing really again wet my brush to help blend it in take a bit more of the bright yellow and as you can see it's really really quick really quick. Sorry if the light's shining on it. Um, you know, I've got that type of sky right now. And I'm uh, just going to wash my brush. And I'm going to take my flat brush. And um, just here. I'm going to start and uh, make it look 
like use some form of uh, building or bush in the background. And you um, can build it up a little bit. making sure that all this at the bottom is completely black And I'm not sure if you can see, but that's the type of sky you've got in the background. I will try and show it a little bit better than that. I'm going to take my fan brush just drying it. And then I'm going to go in with the orange. and blend that in across doesn't matter if you get black on it because you're going to blend that in now take a little bit of the red and blend that in as well a little bit of the um, burnt sienna and darken that <coughs> Start from the edge and then work into the middle, blending in the red again from the edge. And then what I'm going to do is take the black and leave the brush strokes in it. You see, I've left brush strokes because it's blended it in. little bit of water just to help that blend like that Excuse me. <coughs> I'm going to take my little brush again. This one. Take the black and bring that in more and build into the middle. So 
So what you're doing basically is closing that gap. and you've uh, actually got a night scene at the moment um, I will try and pick that up for you to see it um, so this is like your water and um, you've got the light coming through so what I'm going to do next is again to take the flat brush dry it off, dip it in the bright yellow. I'm just going to turn this upside down because I don't want to rest my hand on it. And uh, do a circle. And take a little bit of the white. And there you go. And then down here, where it's going to be reflecting. On the water. And that's all I'm going to do. And uh, it's nearly going off. What I want to do now is just very, very quickly is uh, take the uh, small ended brush again and then using the black is then I put the uh, trees in and just get them in and then what I'll do is take the uh, flat brush again dip it in the black and then do the branches and I'm not sure if you can just see that before it goes off um, and try and get it to uh, can you see putting the branches in um, and then if I quickly wash my brush I'm not going to have time to show you both sides but what I'm going to do is pick up a little bit of the white and just follow that trail So I'm just showing you um, what you can do. The light shining on it. I mean, obviously you can go back over it if it's too much and darken it a little. It's going to go off in exactly a minute. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to take a little small brush and a little bit of the yellow and just in the bottom um, go along and put a bit of uh, grassy bit in and basically that's all I'm doing and, and you've got a night scene picture I'm really sorry that you can't see it properly really really hard but I hope you enjoyed that anyway and I hope it's helped you so um, I might do a flower next thanks for watching bye